It is 2023. Can you believe it? I know I'm sounding like an old man and time flies so quickly, but here we are at the beginning of yet another year. And it's my privilege today to introduce to you our theme verse for Grace Point for 2023. It's Colossians 3.17. And whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. In the name of Jesus. That is such an important phrase in the New Testament. You see it all over the place. And the, the name of Jesus represents his power, his authority. It represents his character, love and grace and forgiveness. And it's the challenge for every believer to be like Jesus. You know, we live in a culture that's changing that so dramatically the mantra that I hear over and over again in conversation, online, in the television programs, people are saying, you be you, you do you. It's a reminder that somehow we're expected to find out who we are inside of ourselves. And the problem is we know we're so messed up and, and we change so much through the years. And, and who you are today is not who you're going to be tomorrow. An interesting thing happened just a, a couple of weeks ago. I was registering for a medical procedure and uh, I was asked, are you still a male? I, I was taken aback by the question, but it's a reminder in our culture that, that people want you to be one thing one day and another thing another day. And, and whoever you feel like you are, that's who you are today. Uh, you, you know those phrases, you be you and you do you, they've actually replaced things like be all you can be or be the best version of you. And, and that's what the Lord is calling us to do. The Lord is calling us to follow Jesus because that's the way we become the best us. Now, I hope you don't misunderstand I'm not talking about some kind of cookie cutter Christianity. The Lord doesn't want you to become a Stepford Christian just like everybody else. The Lord's intent is for all of us to be fully who he designed us to be. And when that happens, not only do we experience the best blessing, but it makes us a blessing in his world. So I'm looking forward to the days that are yet to come. Next week, I'm gonna begin a series on the book of Colossians. And I want you to know what the title of that series is today. We're gonna to call it, You Be Jesus. Because there's too many people out there telling you, you do you, you be you. You have a higher calling in life than that. So make it your goal for 2023. No, more than that, make it your goal for life to be more like Jesus. That's where you'll find the greatest fulfillment, the greatest joy, and you'll make the greatest contribution to God's world. So I'm looking forward to launching into 2023 with you, and I'm excited about the days that lie ahead. Let's leave behind that philosophy of this world, and let's be Jesus in his world. God bless you. Have a great day today and a great 2023.